Hey Vitamart family, welcome back to week two of Psoriasis Awareness Month. Today we're gonna go over eight natural remedies to help heal your psoriasis flare. Stay tuned. What's up Vitamart family, Sarah here. Welcome back to week two of Psoriasis Awareness Month. Last week we went over the basics of psoriasis, what causes it, who gets it, how do you get it, can you cure it, and all of that great information. And today we're gonna go over eight natural remedies to help you combat a psoriasis flare. Without further ado, let's get right in and find out these eight natural remedies that will help demolish a psoriasis flare and help you prevent them from starting to. So natural remedy number one is sun exposure. This is probably the most simple to implement as it is naturally occurring in most parts of the world. So you should start out by covering your healthy skin with proper SPF sunscreen. This is super duper important and if you need help figuring out what SPF you should use, check out our YouTube video on sun care. So start by applying your sunscreen to all your healthy skin. Getting a sunburn can actually worsen the symptoms of psoriasis, so we really want to avoid getting any kind of sunburn whatsoever. The sun contains ultraviolet A and ultraviolet B rays, and it's the UVB rays that actually help heal psoriasis. So put your sunscreen on and go get some sun. Remedy number two is to prevent dry skin. So you can try using a humidifier in your home or office space to keep the air nice and moist to help prevent dry skin from happening. Moisturizers for sensitive skin can help keep your skin supple to help prevent plaques from forming. Natural remedy number three is aloe vera. Aloe vera has been shown in some cases to help reduce the redness and itchiness of psoriasis plaques. In a 2010 study, it was actually shown that an aloe vera cream was slightly better at reducing psoriasis symptoms than the typical steroid cream that's usually prescribed. So remedy or tip number four is to avoid all fragrances. Most soaps and perfumes actually have dyes and chemicals that can really irritate your skin. They may smell great, but they also may increase your psoriasis flares and nobody wants that. Your best bet is to try and pick a natural fragrance free option when it comes to soaps, perfumes, lotions, or shampoos. Natural remedy number five is to soak your skin. It's bath time. A lukewarm water with Epsom salt, olive oil, and even mineral oil can help reduce the redness and itching caused by psoriasis. Oatmeal baths are especially helpful for soothing plaque psoriasis. Hot water can actually inflame the skin more and irritate your psoriasis even further. So make sure the water is not too hot, it's lukewarm before you jump in. Be sure to moisturize immediately after your bath to get double the benefits. Remedy number six is to reduce your stress. As we talked about in video number one, psoriasis is an autoimmune disorder. With any type of autoimmune disorder, higher levels of stress can trigger flare-ups very easily. In addition to being aware of your stress sources and trying to reduce them, try implementing things like yoga or meditation practices to help. Reducing your stress is not only good for your psoriasis symptoms, but it's also good for your overall health. Stress is linked to so many health conditions, so it's better to try and adopt a lower stress life. <laughs> Remedy number seven is to avoid alcohol. I know that may not be the best news to some, but hear me out. Alcohol is a common trigger for people with psoriasis. A 2015 study actually showed women who drank five beers a week were actually twice as likely to experience a psoriasis flare compared to women who didn't drink at all. Tip number eight is to quit smoking. <laughs> smoking is bad for so many reasons, we know it, but if you have psoriasis, please consider quitting smoking. Tobacco has been shown to increase the severity of psoriasis symptoms. It's also been shown to prolong psoriasis flares, making them last much longer and be much more uncomfortable. So if you do smoke and you have psoriasis, you may wanna think about quitting. Thank you for joining me for today's video. I hope this has given you some natural remedies and tips so you can add to your psoriasis fighting tool belt to help reduce the severity of your flares and the frequency. I hope to see you next week for our last video of Psoriasis Awareness Month. Hope to see you then. Don't forget to like and subscribe so you don't miss out and leave us a comment below if you liked today's video. See you next week, Fight Art family. <laughs> Bye.